So the name of our mele is Aloha Kapole Ikalaloa o Makali'i. One, this mele is about having aloha for Kalania Naole, who has gifted to all of us who live in the Aina Pula Pula the ability to be connected to our Aina. The second big mana'o of our mele is to honor our tutu, our tutu, their tutu lady, my grandmother, Ku'ulei Makali'i Whitford. We live in her home here in Kanehili, which is the third increment of Aina Pula Pula here in Kapolei. My grandma's full Hawaiian, but she spoke no Hawaiian. She grew up in a generation where they were told, if you're going to be successful, then you need to be able to speak in English. The ability to bring all of the girls together to create this lei for my grandma was something that I thought, oh, kupaya na haho ikeia. This is such a special thing to be able to do because she was so proud, so proud of the girls that they could speak Hawaiian. Wa ao maila o tutu kuule yamako. Honomako e malama ikeia aina no kamea. Pelano e hoomau ikanani o keia aina o kapule. Pemea vai vai kela e ao ina hanau na mahope o mako. Our ability to use our olelo as a vehicle to tell our stories is not part of a trend, but really it's part of our nohona. It's the way that we live our life. It's the lifestyle that we've chosen. We must hold on to our olelo, our olelo makuahine, always and forever, because it's our foundation um, and it's who we are. It's our kuleana to carry it on to our children and their children after us. They're each their own person. They're each their own individual voice. But when you hear their voices together, you can hear the kahua or the foundation of the family. And that to me was just brilliant. Hono e hana e e e payo me kahana nui me kaiini me kialoha i mea e lana kila ai kalakui lana kila komaku keiki lana kila o tutu lana kila maku apau. And so one of the things about having mele aina pula pula is reconnecting all of us to our land again and reconnecting ourselves to the place that shapes us and molds us and makes us the people that we become.